Hey guys, what's up? Happy Tuesday. Tuesday is usually the worst day of the week, but today is Prime Day and there is a bunch of stuff on sale. There is not a ton of stuff in our industry that's useful to us that's actually having a Prime Day deal right now, but there's still a ton of stuff on sale. So while you're doing your Prime Day shopping, check out some of these goodies. I think you guys are really going to like them. There's a lot of great stuff in here, guys. Don't go anywhere. We're getting started right now. All right, guys, buckle up. There are 30 tabs on this Amazon shopping list. We've got a lot to get through, so let's get right into it. Would this even be a laser everything recommendation list if we didn't kick off the event with some Starrett stuff, guys? 30% off this Starrett caliper. If you don't already have a caliper, you should get one. I recommend getting a good one and then getting some crappy ones that you can throw around or lose or whatever. But the Starrett stuff is awesome, guys. $119.99 for this dope caliper. Uh, it's going to work for you for a really long time. They make good stuff. There's not a lot to say about it. This is the primo stuff, guys, so definitely check this one out. Continuing with the stare at trend, we've got the 135A. Uh, note, this one is not on sale, uh, which is kind of a bummer. The Starrett 135A, all-time favorite level. Great for just about everything laser engraving related. If you don't have one, I would recommend picking one up, but if you really want something on sale, you can check out the Starrett 135B instead. It's just a little bit longer than the 135A, and it is a little bit cheaper than the 135A right now, and you get a bigger level. So if you're doing bigger projects, one of these would be great to have too. Just don't lose it, obviously. It's a $40 level that is this big, so we don't want that running off behind a workbench somewhere never to be seen again, so definitely, Pick up a stair level if you haven't already. They're just so good. They're so good. Some of these are kind of dumb, guys, but permanent markers. Uh, these are the thick boys so that you can go ahead and color in copper or silver if you're having trouble ablating them, especially if you have a weak laser or you're worried about reflections. Nothing like a good Sharpie to get a black surface on there to help with that laser absorption on the surface. You get a four pack right now for $4.44. They're the nice big chunky boys, like I said, so definitely grab a pack of those if you don't have them lying around the house. For all your metal cleaning needs, I've always recommended three in one oil. It's on sale right now. You get a two pack of the three ounce bottles for 10 bucks. So it's an even 10 bucks super good deal this is great stuff guys i use it with both polyester rags and toothbrushes depending on what i'm cleaning it helps seal up steel after engraving it so that it doesn't rust it makes brass engraved brass look so much better if you hit it with a little three-in-one oil there's a hundred uses for it we use it all the time on the channel so three-in-one oil is definitely a no-brainer for this list and it's on sale i'm a big lenovo fanboy i really like lenovo's computers it goes back to when they bought the thing pad brand from IBM and I've just always been a big fan of the ThinkPad machines. Lenovo has done them justice. They're still really good machines ever since purchasing that brand and there are a few ThinkPads on sale. Now you can't get a brand new one on sale right now. There aren't any good Prime Day deals for brand new Lenovo ThinkPads, but you can get one renewed. And this is a great little system here. It's got an i5 in it, one of the mobile versions, eight gigs of RAM and a 256 gigabyte SSD. Perfect for running Lightburn or EasyCAD, and you can pick it up for $269. This is renewed, so it means that they've taken it back uh, for a return for some reason and fixed it and they're reselling it, but I've never had a problem with renewed electronics from Amazon, and I highly recommend this. It's a great deal. If you want something a little bit newer though, and a little bit higher end, you can check out the newer ThinkPad E15s. This one comes with a 15 inch display, the newer version of the Ryzen 5 mobile processor, eight gigabytes of RAM, and a 256 gigabyte flash hard drive, which is awesome. It's got a bunch of different connections, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, everything that you could want from that. And it is under $800. It's 7% off today, which is a great deal. And if you want to save a little bit more money, if we scroll down here, they do offer the renewed version for an additional $140 discount. So you can pick this up renewed and grab it for under 600 bucks, which is an awesome deal too. Either of these ThinkPad computers are going to be great for running your lasers. They're rugged. They're going to last a long time. So I would definitely consider these because you can have them for pretty low prices right now. 
Next up, a ring light. And no, this isn't for you to record YouTube videos. It's actually to mount around the lens on your galvo head. These are perfect for lighting up the area beneath your galvo head and getting your work bed nice and evenly lit so that you can do recordings of projects or even just to see what you're doing. This one's on sale. It's 32% off for $18.99 and it would do a great job lighting up that workspace. The one thing that you'll have to figure out is how to mount it underneath the galvo head so it isn't moving around all the time. And you'll want to make sure that you're not blocking things like red light laser focus assist. So you'll want to keep an eye on that. But this is all the rage right now. Everybody's doing it. And I can see why, guys. It's a no-brainer to pick up one of these. I recommend the 6-inch version for most people's setups. It gives you enough space to get the lens right up inside of the ring light so that the ring light is lighting around the lens coming straight down on your workspace but you should take a measurement just to make sure anyway because you might need one just a little bit bigger next up on the list guys digital multimeter this is the Kaiweets KM601. It's the multimeter we used in our voltage testing video. Even though many people have enjoyed pointing out the fact that you can't sufficiently test a power supply with a multimeter alone, they're still great for recognizing that you have a problem with a power supply and it needs to be replaced. This one was excellent. I really enjoyed it. The first part of that voltage testing video was a review and it's a great little unit and it's only 34, 39, 20% off today on Amazon. Go check it out. It's a great one. Heavyweight construction paper in white is my new favorite thing when doing core file testing. If you slow your laser way down, white construction paper actually makes an incredibly dark, easy to measure mark with a fiber laser. And I just, it's, my mind is blown. This is just a simple pack, guys. It's 15% off, uh, 589 for a big fat stack. Nice big size. It's 12 by 18, so it's going to work for any lens that you've got for the most part. You should be well covered by the paper, and it's a no-brainer, guys. Definitely check it out. I'll throw an episode up eventually, but seriously, just slow. Slow speeds, nice dark mark, white paper, easy to measure. Trust me on this. Grab a pack. Cloud Ray F Theta scan lenses on sale, kind of. Uh, it depends on the one that you're checking out. Some of these are not in stock and thus don't have a deal. Some of them labeled prime are in stock and are on sale. And some of them are labeled as out of stock and on sale anyway. Uh, any of the ones where you see this little coupon here, you can check the box and save an extra 10% when you apply this coupon. So they're already on sale by quite a bit. And then boom, you can check the box and you get an extra 10% on top of that. So great time to buy lenses, especially if you plan on buying off Amazon. You can pick up the Cloud Ray ones, no problem at all whatsoever. I've been using them the entire time that the channel has been on and I've never had an issue. And these are at a great price. And of course you don't have to wait for them to ship from AliExpress. So definitely grab some new lenses. If you are planning on doing it anytime in the near future, now is the time to get those. And right in line with that, uh, same thing for CO2 Galvo users out there, the Cloudray CO2 F Theta scan lenses are on sale. These CO2 Galvo lenses are expensive, guys. So if there's ever any chance for you to get a discount on them, you should jump on it immediately. You get that 10% coupon applied at checkout. They're not on sale the way that the fiber laser lenses are on sale. Still, 10% off $259 is 10% off $259. Better than usual, jump on it if you need them. Finally, for all those CO2 gantry users out there, uh, CO2 gantry focusing lenses on sale. 30% off right now. You're getting that prime shipping. Again, these are the US made CVD lenses. So they're the nicer ones and 26 bucks is a great price. So if you need lenses, again, now's the time to buy. Everybody who needs lenses, buy lenses right now. Cause honestly, I mean, they're on sale like that. Now's the time. I always recommend to everybody that the best lens to have is a range of lenses. So if you're looking to expand and you want more than just one or two lenses in your kit, seriously, go check these out. The more lenses, the better for everybody. I'm, I'm going to stand by that forever. Our new official recommendation for laser eye protection is noirlaser.com, but those lenses are extremely expensive. If you're going to use the ones that came with your machine from China, I would upgrade to at least a pair of the free mascot ones. I think they're better. I've had a lot of anecdotal stories from people that are members of our community that think that these are better, that say their eyes feel better after switching. And while the fiber and CO2 versions of these lenses are not on sale for Prime Day, 
the diode lasers are. And these are actually the most expensive lenses to buy from no IR. So if you're gonna get a cheaper pair, this would probably be the one to get. The free mascots have been great. They have a few different listings that offer a few different styles of frames and they're 40% off today. So I would definitely check these out. They're more expensive than the normal junk that you can find on Amazon for laser eye protection and a little bit higher quality. They're still not the best eye protection that you can get. But again, if you're gonna use the crappy Chinese ones anyway, you might as well as upgrade to a pair like this. People always have a problem with powered USB hubs and their lasers not being recognized by their computers. This is one that works. I use this at home with three lasers and I use it at work with another six and it's always worked every time, no problems whatsoever. It's a little more expensive usually at $40. Looks like it's 20% off right now. So you can pick this up for $31.99 and it is worth it if you are trying to connect multiple lasers or peripherals at once. You've got your mouse, your keyboard, your microscope, your lasers. Uh, you know, you've got all, just there's a lot of stuff, right? We're connecting a lot of stuff to our computers and a port like this will work with your laser machine, specifically EasyCAD boards, which tend to hate USB hubs. So definitely something to look at if you are in need of a device like this. I've tested this one, it works great, and it's on sale, next item. Similarly, the USB-B cables, the printer cables, are super finicky, the ones that come from China. If you don't have them in just the right way, they tend to lose connection, and a lot of people can't even find their lasers on their computers until they replace this cable. You can pick this one up 60% off, a whopping $5.59. I use this on every single laser in my shop, again, tested with that hub, with everything else and it works flawlessly. You can get them in a range of different lengths, and I've had no problems from diode lasers to gantry lasers to galvo lasers. It works every time, so definitely check these out if you are needing to replace yours. Next up, the famous CW5200, everybody's favorite chiller, is actually having a pretty substantial sale right now. Typically, these are $728. That's the price they've been for a long time. That's the price that I paid for mine. It's probably the price that you paid for yours. But if you're watching this video and you don't already have a real chiller, buy one right now. It's a serious 24% off. It's almost a quarter off the retail price. You don't see sales like this very often. And these are genuine when they come from CloudRay. There's so many different fakes out there. It's not even funny. So you can have this one for $500. $51.20 shipped to your door, Amazon Prime. This is a deal, guys. This is probably the biggest deal out of all of the deals in this list. Uh, if, if you're going to save on anything right now, uh, anything in this list at all, the chiller is the thing that you're going to want to pick up. So I know most of us already have them, but if you just happen to be in that sweet spot of time where you haven't gotten one yet, buy yours today. Speaking of chillers, we have the Ohmtech 50 watt. These are like the desktop ones. So they're like, I, I'm in the little camera right now, but they're they're big, they're not that small. They're still fairly big, but it's the cheapest laser that you can get that has a Ruida controller in it. And we all know Ohmtech quality on their gantry machines, okay? This machine is not going to show up running at 100% of what it's actually capable of doing. You're gonna spend some money upgrading it, taking care of it, replacing some parts, and kind of fine tuning things, but it's 9% off, that's, 200 bucks. So if you want to save 200 bucks and you're looking for a CO2 laser, especially one that is compact, I could recommend this one to the right person. You're not going to be doing gigantic projects on a machine like this, and it is going to take a little TLC to get it up to snuff and competitive with some of the nicer stuff out there on the market. But for the price, you really can't beat it. This is like less than half of things that Thunder Laser and Mirror are putting out. Uh, cost wise. So why not take an extra nine, ten percent, whatever off of that price tag and grab a super inexpensive CO2 while you're at it. If you don't already have a CO2, this is a great one to start with. If you don't already have a laser, this could be a great laser to learn laser with. So as long as you know the faults with these machines before you buy them and have a plan in your mind on how you're going to deal with them and you have the constitution to deal with them, uh, they're, they're a big recommend for me. They're not perfect, but they're on sale and this is where a lot of people start. So I would definitely consider picking one up if that sounds like you. Since we're talking about lasers, I just wanted to throw a shout out there to SFX. Their machines are not on sale for Prime Day right now, but I wanted to bring them up because we were here. I got my SFX 60 watt 
M7 from SFX. When did I get it? I don't like November. I actually just finished shooting all of the B-roll for my review, which is going to be extremely positive. It's going to be a very, very positive review. They've been amazing. Their equipment is awesome. Everything is done exactly the way I would want it to be internally. I'm, I'm very, very impressed with the products that they're putting out. And you can't beat that you can just order it on Amazon, right? No customs, no weird shipping stuff that you have to deal with. You click, it shows up on your doorstep. So uh, typically the SFX lasers are a little more expensive than what you can import on your own. You have to pay for that import somehow, right? The company's not just paying it for you. They're just importing it in advance and then adding that cost onto the total. So they are a little bit more expensive than what you're gonna find on AliExpress, but you're not paying import taxes and it's just showing up at your door. So um, I, I'm really happy with my machine, guys. I really, really like the SFX. I can't wait to share that review with you. They have two big ones that I would seriously consider. This is the US stock 50 watt JPT. So this is a JPT LP plus unit. It's got a kilohertz range of one to 400 on the frequency. So you can get some of those nicer anneals and there's a little bit more flexibility. That one comes in at 61.99. I think with the import situation and not paying taxes uh, and that sort of thing on it, it's definitely a good price. It's not the best price ever, but it's a good price from a company you can trust. They also are offering the 60 watt JPT M7 MOPA fiber laser, which is 7,999. It's a little bit more expensive, but you do get that really, really nice 60 watt M7 JPT laser source. And that means full MOPA capability. You're gonna be changing the pulse width. You're gonna be doing colors on steel. You're gonna be doing really fast cutting, things like that. This is the exact unit that I have. It comes with the rotary tool, with a foot pedal, everything you need to get started. And again, I think that the price is fair considering the quality of the product that they're shipping you. I've really hardly had any problems with it whatsoever. I, I really, really, really like it. So um, if you are looking for a fiber laser and you don't wanna deal with the fuss of importing your own, I can wholeheartedly recommend the SFX lasers off Amazon. By the way, they are shipping both of these units that I showed you with EasyCAD two boards. So they are out of the box compatible with Lightburn. So if that's something that you care about, great option for you there as well. Last laser on this list today, and this is technically on sale, though it's still a little bit more expensive than you can get it directly from Orter's website. When you buy it off Amazon, you get the prime shipping. So if you don't want to wait and you want to pay very close to what they're offering this unit for on their own website, now is the time to pick it up. It's $319.99 and it's boom, click it, order it, it shows up. So yes, this isn't technically an amazing deal because you can get it for nearly the same price on Orter's website but you do get the Amazon shipping so if you want it really really fast this is a great way to pick it up right now I think everybody should have a diode laser in their in their setup honestly I'm the biggest diode convert in the world I used to think they were the dumbest things and now I'm like team diode I think that if you don't have a diode laser in your shop you're missing out on capabilities that other people have so uh, this is a great little beginner laser not just for people that are trying to add diode to their setup but people that want to get started with laser at all it's light burn compatible it's a stellar little unit and it comes with great laser diodes that do really really good work they have a nice fine dot size especially for photos they're so nice for photos especially on like softer wood and stuff and just trust me uh this is a stellar unit and if you haven't already seen it i did a review on this specific unit you can check it out in the channel uh, the alfaro laser one from mortar very nice machine so uh technically on sale right now on amazon We've got the Panavice Jr. here. You guys have heard me rant and rave about this if you've been watching the channel for a long time. My only regret is that the larger Panavice 350 is not on sale right now. Still definitely worth picking up, but not on sale. This one is on sale. It's 12% off, usually goes for $32.95. You're getting it for an even 29. It's not the biggest deal in the world, but these things are sweet and you can save a couple bucks. If you don't already have one, they're great for holding just about everything underneath a laser that won't sit there on their own. So definitely worth considering. Another item that I think everybody should have in their shop is a precision screwdriver kit. They're great for electronics, taking apart watches. 
I use mine literally once a week and it's so inexpensive. There's not really a reason not to have one of these. So if you don't already have a precision screwdriver kit, this isn't the normal one that I recommend, but it seems good enough. Honestly, quality doesn't really matter for a kit like this. You just need something with the right bits that works. And this gets the job done. It's 20% off. It's cheaper than a lot of the other ones you're going to find on Amazon. and doesn't look like complete garbage for $19.99 and that's Amazon Prime. So you might want to check out a precision screwdriver kit if you don't already have one. Clear acrylic rulers, guys, perfect, 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 perfect tool for measuring your focal distance if you're trying to cut your own focal sticks. The 12-inch version is 11% off for, again, a whopping $6.79. I prefer the 8-inch version, which unfortunately is not on sale right now, but that is only $12.97. You get a little more use out of the 18-inch one, though, because some of your focal distances may be longer if you're using a really large lens. So... I love these things. They're perfect for measuring that focal distance, guys. That's pretty much all I use it for, but it's just one of those things where I would not be where I am right now if I didn't have one. So uh, definitely recommend checking these out. When I was making this list, I swore these were on sale. I guess they're not. You could probably find some on sale because it's Prime Day, but these are the ones that I buy. Trendbox 50 pack melamine sponges. They're magic erasers, guys. Great for cleaning up your engravings. Not for every engraving, but a lot of the time. I, we use them quite a bit on the channel, especially for cleaning up tumblers. So pick up a pack. You get 50 of them for 14 bucks. You get like six for 30 at the grocery store or whatever. So still a great deal. I thought these were on sale. I guess not. This is something I've been wanting to do on the channel for a while, which is use my Wacom tablet some more. This is a newer version of the one that I own. I've had mine for maybe 10 years now, and they are super cool. They basically let you touch and draw on the screen without touching and drawing on the screen. It's a little touch tablet. It comes with an awesome stylus and a bunch of little different brushes and pen tips that you can use. They've got a huge range for pressure sensitivity, and it can really help you out with your art game. My art game by hand, not very good. I I am a mouse guy for sure, but I've been wanting to break my Wacom tablet out for so long and just kind of like try to use it for the channel because I, I honestly don't think I've touched it since we started the YouTube channel here. So if you are a great artist by hand and you want an easy way to digitize or work in programs like Corel Draw or Adobe Illustrator, one of these Wacom tablets would be sweet for you. It's a great price right now, $340 even. That's 11% off for Prime Day. So definitely check that out. Uh, they make a few different sizes and you can get it bundled with software like Corel Painter or a Creative Cloud, what I'm guessing is a basic kind of starter subscription. And yeah, guys, they're just cool. It's just kind of like a cool thing to have. So if you want to mess around with something like this, there's one. It's on sale. Good company. I've had mine for a long time. A long time ago, we did a podcast episode about must-have laser accessories, and this was one of the ones that I didn't have that I wish that I did, and that's a CO2 fire extinguisher. You can use the dry chemical fire extinguishers, but you're basically destroying whatever electronics you spray with it. So if you spray your laser down with a chemical fire extinguisher, that laser is going to be a write-off. If you get a CO2 fire extinguisher, which is much, much more expensive, there is a chance that you can save whatever you're spraying down. The fire extinguisher in extinguishing the fire doesn't necessarily void your laser. So if you want something like that, it's 5% off. Not a huge discount, but just something that I thought I would bring up. This is another thing, guys, that I think every single laser owner should have in their shop. You can see I've bought this one twice, <laughs> and that is the USB digital microscope, guys. These are not like crazy scientific microscopes. They're kind of quick and dirty microscopes that get the job done, and they give you a webcam view on your computer or phone. Again, I reviewed these in the past. I really liked it. We gave one away. I kept a little bit of a nicer version, one with a screen on it for myself, but this is essentially the same exact thing, minus the screen. Right now, 20% off, $39.97, an excellent deal and something I think everyone should have in their cart if they do not have one sitting next to them right now at their desk. Kyle pointed this one out to me. CloudRay is selling their lift tables at a discount for Prime Day. You can use the coupon to get an extra 20% off applied at checkout, and they seem to be 25% off out of the gate. So you can get a serious discount on these. Excellent if you want to start using things like 300 millimeter lenses. You want to get way, way, way up on that focal distance for maybe something like Project Mark on tumblers. Uh, you can jump into 
the 800 millimeter tower and you're still going to get the 20 percent off on that it's a stellar deal and much cheaper than you're going to find on amazon usually you can find them a little bit cheaper on aliexpress but the shipping time on these is pretty painful so you may want to just grab it from amazon and have it show up at your door but that kind of goes for everything on this list last but not least guys brilliance laser ink awesome stuff you guys have seen this on the channel like a lot of the other things i've done videos on this already it works really really good for being able to mark metal with a co2 laser you can get a small discount on it right now 20 percent off that's 11 dollars off for a total of 43.95 one cam will usually get me through like 20 to 30 tumblers depending on how responsible i'm being with the spray but it's great stuff this is some of my favorite stuff and it's much cheaper than competing chemical catalyst products like this and that's the end of the list there guys i hope you found at least one or two things that you might want to add to your setup this summer like i said there aren't a ton of deals that are specifically prime day deals on this list but i figure everybody's going to be on amazon shopping for prime day and there are a few items industry relevant that are on sale so hopefully you got something out of this one prime day runs through the end of july 13th it's the 12th right now i'm gonna have this video up in an hour or two uh we're it's like five o'clock guys i'm 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 running here we're, we're trying to get it done so uh you'll have all day tomorrow to shop and of course if you need anything we've got all the links down in the description below clicking them really helps support the channel i appreciate you guys shopping through the affiliate links when we do post them if you guys got value out of this video don't forget to smash the like button let everybody else know the content is good and don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so that you get notified the next time we upload a video if you guys love laser everything and you want to help support the channel go check out the laser master academy it's the number one way to support the channel and the only reason that the channel is here and free for everyone to enjoy and learn from is because of our supporters over at the lma I don't like locking things behind paywalls. So all of the important information that we have on Laser Everything goes up on the YouTube channel for free for everyone. If you wanna make sure that that continues, signing up for the LMA is a great way to do it. If you'd like to show your support, head over to masters.lasereverything.net and join over 2000 people that are already supporting the channel to help Laser Everything become even bigger and better than it already is. Anyway guys, I need to get this episode cut and uploaded so that you can take advantage of it. And then I need to go do some shopping myself. I have some things that I need to pick up for the shop and for the channel. So I'm going to grab those things too. But thank you so much for watching this episode of Laser Everything. And I will see you in the next one.